Hey guys, it's Megan. I'm back today to teach you about how I do my winged liner. There are so many liners and techniques these days. I'm going to show you the product I use and show you how I use them. There are a ton of liners that are on the market today. There are pencil liners, creamy pencil liners, liquid liners, gel liners, pen liners. There are also felt tip and brush liners. My favorite to use is the pen liner. This is the Kat Von D Tattoo Liner in Trooper. The tip just looks like that. It's a brush liner, but the brush is kind of stiff. It draws really precise lines. And that's what I find easiest to use. It's just like drawing with a pen on your face. There are a ton of techniques on how you can do your wing line. I started off learning how to do it by using the tape method where you put a piece of tape going from your bottom lash line and going up and just tracing along that line. So that's one way to start out if you're a beginner using the tape method. I will show you how to do the tape method. So you grab your scotch tape, you take a piece off, and what I like to do is stick it on my hand and then peel it off. That makes it not as sticky to put on your sensitive skin area under your eye. And you line it up with your bottom lash line. And I like to line it up with my eyebrow. You can put it wherever you'd like, lower down or further up. Just stick that on there. And it's not on there as good just because you did put it on your skin and that's what you want. You don't want to have to rip the tape off of your sensitive skin right there. So you take your eyeliner. This is how I like to do it. You can do it with your own personal preference, how you feel comfortable doing it, but this is how I do it. So I start by creating the wing line. You just draw a line along the tape and then I go from the corner and work my way out. And I just go really slow with small strokes. And if you make any mistakes, you can go back and clean it up later. So then I take from the corner where my wing is and I start a little bit down just so that it like kind of feathers out and I just drag that straight across. Like so. And it should look something like that. And then I fill it in. And then you remove the tape. And there you go. And you can fill up like that area right there. You can leave it. Um, I like perfect eyeliner so I like to fill in any of the spaces that is missing eyeliner so it doesn't look like a crooked line. It does take some practice. You're not going to get it the first day. I didn't. Um, it took a lot of trial and error and how I felt comfortable doing it. I don't know what it is. Like My neighbors come outside every single time I'm filming and they make it incredibly awkward just because I am sitting in front of my window and they can see me. Like all of me. Inside my room. Everything. <laughs> it's really awkward and embarrassing. So that's just one way for beginners to do their wing liner. It does get easier with time. I do still make mistakes, but it's all trial and error. Soon you'll get the hang of it. I have really good wing liner days. I have really bad wing liner days. Now I will show you how I do my wing liner every single day on this eye without the tape. Hi, Double Chin. How are you doing? I do it the exact same way. 
I draw the line first and then I fill it in. I don't know about you, but I cannot do eyeliner and talk. Like, there's just something about that that like I can't do. Like, texting and walking, I just can't do it. And I really found out that like the closer I am to my eye, the easier it is. I am pretty far away right now, so it's a little bit more difficult than like an everyday wing liner. So that's how I learned to do my wing liner and how I do my wing liner today. There are a couple steps that I do to finish my eye look after I'm done drawing on my wing liner. I fill my waterline and my tight line with a pencil just to make it more dark and then I add some lashes. So I will do that now and I'll be right back. So that's how I do my wing liner and finish up my look. I will put all the products I use down in the description for you. If you were wondering what color I have on my lips today, it is this Kat Von D Everlasting Liquid Lipstick in Beloved. Hopefully I taught you how to slay your winged liner. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, subscribe. I will put my Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter down below for you so you can go check me out on social media. And I hope you guys have a great day, and I will see you on Thursday. Bye!